Hello, and welcome to the Northern Regional Medical Command News. I'm Ann Krebs. We operate seven medical military treatment facilities from New York to North Carolina. Each is dedicated to improving the health of our Army family. That includes soldiers, their families, retirees, and civilian staff. This program highlights the latest in health care across the region. The focus of the Northern Regional Medical Command is on the delivery of quality care, patient safety, patient satisfaction, and access to care. NARMSI recently hosted a summit at Fort Belvoir, Virginia, led by the Army Surgeon General, Lieutenant General Patricia Horho. The Surgeon General told NARMSI News that Army Medicine is comparing its performance to civilian health care systems. We made a decision within military health care to actually compare ourselves to the best of the best in the civilian hospitals. So only 84 hospitals that provide OB services choose to share their data. And we compared ourselves to those 84 out of 5,000 hospitals. In surgical care, only 10% of the hospitals that provide surgical care in the United States share their data. We compared ourselves to that 10%. So we compared ourselves to the best of the best because we ask America's sons and daughters to place themselves in harm's way. We should be leading in those areas. At Northern Regional Medical Command Military Treatment Facilities, Quality Care Chief Elaine Fleming says the Army Medicine commitment translates to an intense focus on the patient. I want patients to, to, to um, know and to believe that we, we, we hear you, we see you, and we're here for you. So that's what, I, that's what I'm hoping us becoming a high reliability organization will be to that patient. We care, we hear you, we see you, and we want to provide you with the best possible care that you can get. The High Reliability Organization Summit outlined NARMSI's path to exceptional consistency in all our facilities, which we believe will lead to the best possible health care outcomes for our patients. At Fort Lee, Virginia, Kenner Army Health Clinic recently conducted a week-long program of education and advocacy supporting Cervical Cancer Awareness Month. Kenner focused on getting patients who were overdue for cervical cancer screenings up to date. Since 2010, the Warrior Games have showcased the power of sports and competition in the rehabilitation of wounded, injured, and ill service members. The Northern Regional Medical Command will host its regional games February 9th through 13th. Athletes from across the region will compete in seven sporting events. The top athletes participate in the Warrior Game Trials next month at Fort Bliss, Texas. And that's Northern Regional Medical Command news for February. Join us next month for another edition of Narmsey News. In the meantime, don't forget to check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest. Thanks for joining us.